Hey everybody, it's Joel, and I'm back for another video. And um, last video was video number 9 for Super Mario Galaxy 2. And in this one, or last one, I left off here. I got into World 3. Um, I did the Tall Trunk Galaxy, Cloudy Court Galaxy. Uh, there is a hidden star here. Um, notice how I have 28 stars now. I had, I think, 25. Um, I did go ahead and got some more hidden stars. Um, I'm kind of glad I did because I needed, it took me a while to figure out how to do some of them. So, but I'm still going to go back in this video and start showing you how I got them. That way, because I'm sure, you know, there's people that may not know how to get those uh, hidden stars. And, uh, you know, I want to be able to uh, share that with people to help them out. So, um, what I'm going to do is go back, go here, let's go back to where we need to start. I can get there. Okay. All right. Uh, now I got a extra star here, a hidden a hidden star rather, and I completed this galaxy. Uh, you could tell because I got the crown next to it. Um, I got a hidden star here, so I got one Honey Bloom and Cosmic Cove. I also got one here, Hightail Falls, which is really hard. <laughs> I'm not even going to tell, how many, tell you how many times it took me to do that. Um, and first though, as I went back to World 1, I had to go back here and do the Chimp Challenge and also get the Hidden Star here. So I had to do all those just to get 28. So uh, no matter how much you may want to proceed and just keep going through the game, you're always going to need to go back at some point and get some more stars. So I'm went ahead, I'm going to show you how I went ahead and got these. I'm going to start off with the Fluffy Bluff Galaxy and then Hightail Falls, I'll, I guess I'll do. All right, and then I'll probably end the video and then start another one after that. So let's get started. Now, since I already got the hidden star here, um, the hidden star you actually have to get when you get enough coins. Um, you're gonna have to feed a uh, a pink luma, and when you feed the pink luma the coins, it turns into a transform uh, or a transport star. Now, since I already did this, you're not gonna have to see me feed the luma again, but that star is still gonna be there. So um, every you know everything that I'm doing right now, you're still gonna need uh, to do this. Now, this is actually a hard challenge. You got to walk up to the chimp and he challenges you, you basically got to stomp on all those enemies' heads and earn 10,000 points or more, which it's almost impossible. It took me a million tries and then I figured out that, because uh, what happens is every time you stomp on an enemy, you get a coin. So naturally you want to go get the coin and you think that's how you're going to get your points. But the secret really is that you want to jump on their heads consecutively without touching the ground. If you can keep jumping on as many enemies as possible, you're going to get, that's how you're going to get your points. And if you do that good enough, you don't even have to get the coins after you kill the enemies. You can just keep going because you get so many points for for just consecutively jumping on them. So let's see if I, how I do this time. I might have to do it a couple times here because it, it's not the easiest thing in the world. Okay, you got to click yes to do it. Yes! That's how you do it. Just forget that other guy, because, like I said, you're going to get your points doing this. Whoop. Well, could have used more there, but...
Yes. Handstand. Woo! You get a thousand points for getting that one up, so you gotta make sure you give yourself enough time to do it. And then that's how you get the hidden star. And again, I've already gotten it, so it's clear. But that's how you do it. And just grab it. Okay, so that's how I did that. And... Let's go back. Alright, and then I had to go back again to get the last uh, star. This one is kind of tough. It's not like the challenge. There's no... Well, I guess there is sort of a time limit because you have you have to get like a hundred coins to feed the pink luma in this one. Now again, since I already did it, you're not going to see the the uh, pink luma uh, because you know I've already fed him, so he's going to just look like a transport star already. And basically, what you want to do is you could be Luigi here, I think, or you could follow him and let him show you where to go. Uh, it took took me a while to figure this out. But what you can do, you got to get 100 coins from the beginning of this all the way up until, you know, where you got to get the star. And you can start off here. There's some coins here. You got to hurry up because they will disappear. Oh, oh well. I uh, got some there, and there's a couple miscellaneous ones. Here, uh, you could have. I could have stomped on him to get an extra one. Uh, you could just, you know, grab these first few, I guess, that you see, and then wait for this thing to run and to wait for that thing to stomp you. I guess you could stop there. Um, you're gonna need the cloud, the cloud power up again. That's sitting there. So, but there's a pipe. If you come around this tree, there's a pipe here. You gotta come around here. Now this is gonna be crazy because when you get this, it's gonna be just a little square of coins, and it's not gonna look like much. But you gotta, if you hurry up and get them before they disappear, then it's gonna turn into a big circle of coins. And then you have to run around and get that. And if you get them all, then it's going to turn into a bigger square, and with some going down the middle. And if you get all that, then you know that's really where you're going to get the most of your coins. If you don't, if you don't make it here, you're going to have to start all over because you won't get this question mark again. You'll have to go back to the ship or you know start the going to this galaxy from start from scratch. Kind of like that. Or actually, you know what? I can do... I could just go from here. go here and you get shot up here and then this is where the pink luma is supposed to be but like I said I already got them so it's just the star that can transport you where you need to go but you got to get this and get the coins again all right and if you get all those now, I didn't get a hundred coins there because I did miss some at the beginning when I went down that pipe. You're supposed to get, you know, all the rest. And then you just come get this checkpoint. 
come up here. Up here. Uh, there's a one up over here. clouds. Come up here and get this other cloud. And come up here. And you gotta be kind of smart about how you use these. Another one. And there. That's how you get the star. Now, like I said, the only thing you want to do better than me is when you go around that circle, when you go down that pipe, make sure you get all the coins in that circle, and then it'll turn into a square of, cir of coins. And uh, get that, and you should get enough to get you a, a hundred. You know, I was missing like, you know, I can't remember, like maybe 16 or 17 that, that I missed, but anyway. That's how you do it. That should help still save you some time because when I first got in there, I didn't know what I was doing. It took forever. Alright, let's go back here. So that ends up finishing that galaxy when you do all that. And let's go back to World 2. And I had to get a hidden star here. And I'll show you next how I did that. It's this one, yeah. Hope everyone's doing okay today, by the way. Okay, so here we go. When you get here you're gonna to need to get as many coins as you can because you're gonna need 30 coins to feed the Lumo. So start off getting that enemy there. Get a coin. Oh. Okay, get that coin. Get Yoshi. Get these coins. And then get the pepper. Get up here. Try to stay in control. Blast off there. You're going to need to get that question mark up there and get all those coins that it gives you, plus some ahead of it. You're probably going to need to do this more than once if you don't get the path right. Like that, you're going to miss a few, so just get them, get those, and... Alright, just go back up. Just try and stay in the middle. If you fall, you'll be okay. And if you gotta do it a few times, just do it, you know, until you get them all. Because by the time you're done, you'll get 26. You should have 26 coins. Like that. Now I gotta go back up, though, because he got me. Yo, Shiki, down here. And just go back up. Alright, and blast off here. You're gonna get to a checkpoint here. Don't get it, because if you lose, or if you know if you fail and you die, you can start back off at the beginning and get all those coins again. Otherwise you'll never make it if you start off here. Alright, try to start off maybe a little bit over here on an angle because this coin is right here and you want to you want to be able to get it without having to turn Yoshi too much because these platforms are all going to start falling and you want to try and stay as straight as possible. Alright. 
Oh no! Yes! When you get here, you're gonna go to another checkpoint. Again, you know, don't get it so that you can start over at the beginning. And this, oh man, just for me spinning it went. Well, now I gotta make it or I'm gonna be done anyway. All right, as you can see, this lady's here to help you do it, um, especially if you fail like over and over and over again. So that's why she's there, but I'll, I'm not gonna use her. You gotta be careful again. You gotta get the pepper, go all around here and try not to fall. If you can make it across, then you should be home free at this point. I got 36 coins. All I need to do is try not to die here. Alright, great. And you're home free at this point. Just go across the bridge, and this is where... You see this star here? This is where the pink Luma was, and I had... To, you're gonna have to talk to him and feed him, and then he turns into this, and this planet right here gets created. So you use this to transport there. And you're gonna need Yoshi because you gotta get some you gotta get five silver stars. And you're gonna need Yoshi to eat these things. So you can get the stars. Just like springing out of the ground. So, oh, here he is. Get you, come here. No, Yoshi, don't you dare run, Yoshi. They're like just springing out of the ground. All right, where'd that guy go? Where are you? I won't hurt you. Where are you? There he is. Got it. All right, so you get five of them, and that turns into the hidden star. And then you just basically go ahead and jump up and get it. Okay. back and that ties up you know high tail falls so we did the world one fluffy bluff galaxy that we did the chip challenge plus the hidden star and we came to high tail falls got that hidden star and in the next video I'm going to show you how I got the hidden star for cosmic cove and for honey bloom galaxy and all those combined gave me the 28 stars I needed to progress within world three so uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Alright, thanks.